My name is Jillian Laub. I'm a photographer, a filmmaker, storyteller, and the creator of Family Matters. I've been photographing my family for decades, and I never really thought of it as a project. It's just something I did, and it was more like my therapy, really. I think in 2016, that was the turning point where it just became apparent that there was a real division in my family when they became such passionate Trump supporters. The work really helped me navigate that and the past few years I've realized that the story that I thought I was telling or trying to figure out or navigate for myself through making pictures of my family really said something larger, I think, about family and what so many families are going through. My name is David Katznelson and I'm the CEO of Reboot. Reboot is a network of uh, storytellers, a network of people who tell stories in all different kinds of ways, in people in movies and film, scholars, journalists, writers. Jillian Laub is somebody who is exciting to partner with for Reboot. You know, Reboot at its, at its best is telling these new Jewish stories for us to grasp and for us to kind of like understand and translate our current realities. We have partners all over the country who look for us to showcase new and interesting Jewish stories and art. Having someone as stellar as Jillian um, as a partner um, is great for us because it, it allows us to, to be attached to something that is truly signature and truly incredible and a story that you won't get anywhere else. And um, for Reboot, it's just, it helps the organization you know, fulfill its mission. I love engagement and conversation and what is the work there to do if it's not to have these conversations. So my hope for CJM was to have a place where we could hear other people's stories and, and that could be recorded. When we were ideating and figuring out who would be the perfect partner, I said Silver Screen Studios and that's when I contacted Tiffany Wolf. My name is Tiffany Wolf. I am the founder and CEO of Silver Screen Studios. I started Silver Screen Studios a few years back. My parents died young. And I realize as I've gotten older, I don't have the role models of what it means to be a well-lived 80-year-old, to have a great last act of your life. So uh, I picked up a camera and started filming older role models and people in my life that I wanted to capture their stories. Thankfully, um, with the help of Reboot, um, I made this passion project into a full-time job by creating Silver Screen Studios, which um, we've made about five different documentary series at this point. We have had such the good fortune of interviewing celebrities and high profile legends that we love, but some of the best stories are those that are everyday people that have stories that are even more remarkable than a Hollywood movie. And so for us to get this opportunity um, to try to, to capture these stories, for people to share themselves and some personal experiences around their own family dynamics is really a privilege. The amazing thing about Jillian Lapp's work is it's so personal, but it's so universal at the same time. So even though it's a very personal story, I felt walking through her exhibition that she was capturing my own family, that she somehow had peeked into my background and my memories and my own photos of my family um, because there was so much that resonated with me that was similar and that just felt familiar. This was an opportunity to premiere this new idea with It's All Relative. So after folks walk through the Family Matters exhibition, there's a reflection and response space for people to share their own stories. At Silver Screen Studios, our motto is that everybody has an extraordinary story to tell, and some of the best stories just haven't been told yet. When Reboot initially brought artists together, the idea was to just kind of explore what our inheritance is as Jews and what, if anything, we want to do about it. Then all of a sudden these projects started coming up because these storytellers who think big tend to um, think big about things they're excited about. Once they figured out what their, this inheritance was and this ability to make it their own, all of a sudden these great ideas came from it. And uh, a lot of the partnerships and a lot of the projects that we've created are because of the ideas that have come from this. Tiffany Wolf, who is probably the warmest, uh, kindest individual who I've ever met after going to Reboot and after kind of pondering some of these ideas of storytelling in her own life, decided that she wanted to create a, you know, a oral, you know, history of what it's like to age since she didn't have 
the mother or father aging um, to ask them. And so she decided to go out to other mothers and other fathers and other grandparents and other people who were just older to kind of ask what that was like. And Reboot saw such value in it. Um, and so we were lucky enough to fund the beginnings of this and bring a, uh, another Rebooter named Noam Dromi on board to kind of help uh, Tiffany kind of frame it and to mold it and to kind of get it out into the world. An unforeseen consequence is you bring these people together and there's also natural collaborations that happen. With Jillian and telling her family story, um, she's in a way telling a story similar to the kind of stories that Tiffany wants to tell using a different medium. For the people who are seeing these stories, they're gonna have their own reactions. That's what stories are about. Someone's telling their story and it unlocks your own story. And that's exactly what uh, Silver Screen Studios is attempting to do. All of a sudden this collaboration happened almost out of nowhere and a beautiful thing has occurred because of it.